Welcome to the AMS training series for Street Saver Online. Introduction to Modules. After you log in, you will see this screen, which is the main navigation panel to all of Street Saver. If you single click on any of the modules, the available submodules will appear in the lower section of the panel. Let's review the different modules. First, we have pavement sections. This module is used to manage all the roads in your Street Saver database. Then, we have the inspections module, which enables you to manage all the road inspection tasks and calculate the condition of the roads. Next, we have maintenance treatments. This provides a historic track record of road maintenance and projects future maintenance needs. We then have the GIS toolbox, which allows you to spatially display the road conditions, maintenance treatments, and more. The budgeting module provides you with budget needs and maintenance and rehabilitation options based on road conditions, types of treatments, and available funds. The Asset Management module enables you to log and edit street names. After that is Table Maintenance. This module maintains information such as functional class, treatment types, unit costs, service types, funding sources, and more. This database will be used by the Reporting module to calculate conditions and treatments. The reporting module creates charts, graphs, and reports based on road conditions, budgets, treatment decision trees, costs, and more. The system administration module allows you to manage your Street Saver account, including user and backup administration. The utilities module provides you with the toolbox for Street Saver. You can import and export data such as inspection units, section attributes, and more. If you want help by referring to Street Saver's online documentation, go to the top of the bar, single click on help, select help, and a new window will open with documentation on every module. This concludes the introduction to modules.